Hi everyone, Liz here. So today I have an unboxing and look at the size of this box. It is huge. So I've had to just bring it in here so that I can open it and show you. And I'm on a bit of handheld at the minute, so if it's a bit shaky, I do apologise. But yeah, so this is from Craft Buddy. And this is the long awaited Disney. Yay! We have some Disney products to show you. So let me get them out of this box and I will go through them with you and show you what I've bought. Okay, and I'm back. Look at this haul. What I'm going to show you today is the greetings cards that they've brought out. They're all the crystal art, the top quality that I absolutely love. Um, I think you'll know that Craft Buddy is very close to my heart um, because it's how I got into diamond painting and crystal art. So I absolutely love them. Um, and the box that I got didn't just have these in, it had other things in as well. And I'll show you those another day. But so this unboxing doesn't get too long. I'll show you all my cards first. And I did get a notebook as well. So let me just pile all these up. I'm not going to open every kit, but I will show you them one by one and we'll have a look. Okay, but actually, let's have a look at the notebook first. Um, it's the same as the Crystal Skull notebook that I did. Um, there is a video on that, uh, the unboxing, and I will be doing um, a sealing of it and an update on that um, in another video if you keep an eye out. Um, so They come in a lovely package. Um, you get all your instructions on the back there, and it is licensed Disney art. So you can legally buy these. You've got your Craft Buddy logo there. You've got your Disney logo at the top. They are allowed to use it. Um, as I say, they've got the license through Disney. Unfortunately, you can't sell these. They are just for personal use. Okay, let's have a look at this notebook. These are hardback notebooks, which... Let's just check, I've got everything out of the box there. As far as I know, Craft Buddy are one of the only companies that actually do a hardbacked notebook. So let's have a look. We've got Rafiki there. We've got Simba up there, look. We've got Mum and Dad. We've got, oh, is it Yazoo? Yeah. Oh, I can't remember his name. I'm sure you're all shouting it. But I do know Timon and Pumba. I love Pumba. And they're all on Pride Rock, look. It's when he was born. Oh, so cute. So it's partial. You don't do the actual background. You just do the bit where it's sticky where the uh, drills go yes yeah, so you've got all your different colors oh, i just think it's wonderful these notebooks as well they've got the logo in the inside and they are lined as well which i like best and you have got little marks at top and bottom if you can see that at the bottom there you've got a row all along you can just see little dots and they also match at the top there. So if you want to make this into a grid so you can mark things off, do your accounts in it, write your diamond paintings in, tick them off as they're done, then you can put grids into it as well. But I think they're super book. And you also get your ribbon so you can mark where you're up to, like your bookmark. Okay, but yeah, these are so super. And this one's for me. I'm going to use this one because uh, I love Lion King. Um, it was one of the first films I took the children to see at the cinema um, and my little steps, he was only four at the time, bless him, he just curled up on my knee and went to sleep but we've watched it hundreds of times since and I think I know it just about off by heart I certainly know all the songs off by heart, that is for sure so what else do we get? We get a little, uh, again, instruction leaflet telling you how to diamond paint there and uh, yeah, we've got DMC codes there which is wonderful so you've got your little codes your letters there telling you where your drills go and then I do believe that they are DMC numbers yeah there will be 5200 is the white yeah so they're DMC numbers and it even tells you how many drills you've got they do give you 30% extra drills so you should never run out but if you do just contact Craft Buddy and they will um, get something sorted out for you. Uh, it's a partial drill. Look, it's showing you there that uh, the head's not 
and and uh, is it Simba aren't actually diamond painted but it's showing you the area that is so it just gives you an idea of what you're going telling you the size is 18 by 26 centimeters so let's just have a look at that where did I put my tape measure tape measure tape measure <gasps> lose my head if it wasn't screwed on so yep so we're 17 that way and about 25 and three quarters that way it's actually 10 inches by seven inches so yeah a nice size book it's just slightly larger than uh, some of the others that you get some of them are only like a, a five by seven but these are a great size but still good enough to pop it into your handbag i think they're about the size of an ipad mini uh, no, it's the same size actually as my iPad, which I think is the 10 inch iPad. Yeah, it's the same size as that. So that's great. Uh, you get one up from a standard toolkit. So you get some baggies, you get your boat, your wax and you get a three place there on your pen. So it's an okay toolkit. It's enough if you just wanted to say take this away with you to do or if you've got a long car journey or a train journey. I'm not sure whether you're allowed to take them on planes. Not that anybody's going anywhere at the moment, but uh, yeah. Okay, so lots of browns in this one. I am so pleased we've got DMC codes on. Um, got white, and that's not black. It's like a really dark grey. And then these will be all the lion colours. Look, you oranges and browns and rusts and beiges. Look at all those colours. I do like Craft Buddy because they use so many different colours. I mean, that's how many colours is that? What does it say? No, it doesn't tell me. What have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Actually, fourteen different colours on a picture that is that size. That's a partial. That's amazing. Um, and that's what gives you the depth of colour. Coming across here, look, you've got all the different colours just to give you the gradient so that you actually um, can see like a 3D effect, like a depth on them. Wonderful. Love that. So that's going to be one of my in-between ones to do. It'll only take maybe a couple of hours at the most. Depends how many interruptions I get. <laughs> You know what it's like when you start diamond painting. Oh, I'll pop that back in the box later. And they're £12.99, the books. Now then, let's have a look at the cards. This is the first set of cards that they've brought out. All the kits are the same, but obviously there are different drills. Some of them have um, special drills in. So this one is Bambi and Thumper. Okay, and... Is that a flower? I think Bambi called the sea, uh, skunk flower. You can see. So I love Thumper. Thumper the bully. Okay, and you can see they're a partial. If you look on the inside cover, it gives you the eight that they've launched at the moment. Um, they are bringing out new ones. And if you've got any suggestions, then give them an email or go on to the Facebook group. Um, they do have a great Facebook group with a lot of members and we're all real friendly and helpful and they can answer lots of questions. Um, but yeah, you can see there, look, all your different colours. And again, it's just the background isn't diamond painted, but all the little animals have all got the crystals on them. And then you get your toolkit in the back. So you've got your toolkit again. It's like one up from a basic toolkit because you do get your three placer and your baggies and all your drills nicely packaged there and your envelope so the brilliant kits these i'll go through each of the pictures first and then we'll open one and have a look inside it but i absolutely love that look at the bunny's face little thumper that's great it's lovely for uh, presents i mean this just say eight plus but my six-year-old granddaughter has done these and I have a five-year-old nephew that's done some uh, diamond painting stickers as well. Just a bit of supervision. Um, but yeah, you know, they can get used to doing their numbers and letters if you uh, help them, showing them where they uh, B 
bits go on them, where the little drills go. Uh, obviously, you need to open the packets, so maybe um, put them in little plastic containers first, so they're not having to use scissors. And once all the drills are out and numbered, you wouldn't need them to use scissors, so they would just need the boat, the wax and the pen there to get going. So, yeah, lovely. And then we have a mini mouse. Now, I know a lot of uh, ladies and young ladies and girls that would like this one, not just the youngsters, because it's got flamingos on it. She's got her pink bow and she's, oh, she's got sunglasses there. She's not got them on here. It's obviously not such a sunny day today, but she's got her old palm trees around her and everything. I think Disney seems to transcend the different generations. We've all got our favourite Disney um, and we've all got our favourite memories of them. And again, oh, I can see that that one's got an AB in it. So some of them have got crystals, some of them have got ABs. And again, your toolkit. So that's Minnie Mouse. And then we've got Winnie the Pooh, which is my favourite. I love Winnie the Pooh. Um, we love Tigger in this house and we also love Eeyore. Um, we managed to be lucky enough to go to Disneyland Paris when the children were younger and we all had a big cuddle of Eeyore because we like Eeyore. It's a cute little piglet there. And Pooh Bear, he's lovely. There's a little red top on there. That's great. Looks like there's quite a few crystals in this one. Oh yeah, you can see just popping through there. So say, I'm not going to open all the drills, but you can sort of see the different colours there and the different ones. So very special these. And I think if you've seen any of my videos where um, I've made up the cards into other things, I mean, you could actually make these into pictures. Craft Buddy do sell little frames. Um, if you check on their website, there is a frame that these will fit in. So you could do a series of them on your wall. Uh, great for children's bedrooms, great for your own bedroom or even your living room. If you like Disney, then you like Disney and you'll put it everywhere. <laughs> OK, then we've got Nala and Simba. Oh, look at that. It's when they were babies. That's really cute. Oh, look, little face is really smiley, a really happy card, that one. And again, we've got crystals in this one. Lots of browns, but looks like the tree is green there. I don't know if you can just make that out. You've got some green crystals in the background there. Okay. And then we have the snowman from Frozen. Little Olaf, look. And he's floating away with all the leaves. This looks autumn, doesn't it? I hope it's coming winter for him, otherwise it might melt. <laughs> okay. And, yep, yeah, you've got all your drills there. Some lovely colours and all your kit there. Frozen, they've brought out a new film, didn't they? So it uh, seemed to have a resurgence, but there's still an awful lot of little girls going to parties dressed as uh, Frozen, either Anna or Elsa. It's a lot of Elsas because I think the blue dress is one of the favourites. Apart from my little niece, who went dressed as a superhero. <laughs> my niece in Australia, they had a superhero party instead of a princess party for her friends and the little girls. And then we have Mickey. Everybody knows Mickey Mouse. He's uh, one of the favourites, I think. And uh, yeah, there is, a, I think, a TV programme. I think it's still on. Um, I know the grandchildren have watched it where you go on and it's like a learning programme with Mickey Mouse. Is it Mickey Mouse Clubhouse, I think it's called? Um, that's your drill field there. Look, he's quite a lovely big size Mickey Mouse. So you could put a board around and put him in a bigger frame and he'd be lovely in the colours there. Look, we've got leaves in the background. We've got a zebra there. And we've got a little lion in the background as well. Oh, he's cute. So, and then your drills all in the back there. The super quality, these drills as well. You hardly get any trash. Um, let me just move those to one side because that pile's going to fall over in a second. Uh, yeah, you hardly get any trash. And they just slot onto the uh, cards really, really well. So this is another little girl favourite, or big girl favourite. And this is your little mermaid, Ariel. Okay, look at that. Uh, that's your card. She 
is lovely. Look at all this sparkly flower. That looks like um, an orchid. Undersea. You've got all your little seahorses there as well. That she's talking to. Do you know, it's actually one of the films I'm not seeing. I must get to see that one. And again, I don't know if you can see that. We've just got sparkly drills there. And it looks like there's some Aurora Borealis and AB drills as well. That's the special coating, so it just makes them shine a little bit more. Okay, so that's your Disney princess. And then we've got Finding Nemo with Nemo and Dory. Look at that. Oh, it's Marlin, it says. So this is maybe from the uh, latest film. Was Dory not? I think Dory was one of these fish. Maybe Marlin's a bigger fish. Yeah, I must catch up on my Disney. Um, it's this lockdown. We haven't really seen the grandchildren much in the last year, so <laughs> I'm missing out on all my Disney films. And then there's your drill field. Oh, and your little fish there, little eyes. And all your drills, which is super, all nice and sparkly. Oh, look at that orange. Wow, that's going to look really good. Okay, so that's the eight cards they've brought out. Which one shall we open? Which one shall we open? We'll open Princess, we'll open the Mermaid and we'll have a look and see what's in here. Okay, so they do just, you can tear them um, off, but I just like to keep mine. <laughs> I don't know why I keep everything. It's been a crafter. I think I'm just loath to throw anything away. So that's your picture there and let's have a look at this card okay all so nicely packaged toolkit oh there's a lot of bags in there and now then they look a little bit thicker bags i don't think they've got the red stripe on so let's have a look at these it's your pen with your three placer there yeah just your three placer. Oh, tiny bit of wax, but you don't really need much because it's only... Oh, yes, these bags are excellent. These are a really good thick bag with a good seal on them. Yeah, if you just push them sideways, it, it tends to open them. But yeah, you've got plenty of bags there. Goodness me. So, mm, one up on the toolkit. Very good. Just pop that back in there for now and let's keep them all together. And then I sort them all out into a great big box and then decide what I'm going to do with them. <laughs> I think I'll have to um, be posting on one of the websites to see if anybody wants any spare trays. I know some people do those great big stacks, don't they, of all the different green trays with all the different colours in. Um, unfortunately, it's not something I can do. I'm so clumsy. If I had one of those big trays, you could guarantee at some point I would knock it over or Millie, our little Scotty, would knock it over and it would just be carnage. So I'm better just sticking to the little boxes and just tipping in and out. Okay, so let's look at these colours. Wow, so we've got a corally peachy colour there. We've got a, a nice greeny colour. These will all be for her tail. Oops, where's my card? Where's my card? Let's have a look. Yeah, oh, look at that. That has got one, two, three. There's five different colours on Ariel's tail. That is amazing. So we've got the coral and the green. And um, that colour green, and then we've got a lovely lilac. Now that is um, coated, that's an AB. I don't know if you can see, it just has that extra sparkle on it, just an extra coating. And then we have our crystals, which are pink, and like a darker pink, not quite hot pink, but a darker pink. And then we've got a green crystal there as well, which will just highlight all the picture. So that's great. I love those colours. So let's give the card a measure. Let's have a look. They're a good thick card as well. I don't know if you can hear that. They're uh, probably 300 GSM, maybe more. They're a good card. Great for standing up. They're not one of your flimsy ones that are going to do the bambi legs and curl in and fall off your mantelpiece. They're going to stand there. And I think once somebody's put one of these out, they're not going to put them away again. These are going to be out for a long time. 
Okay, so the measurement is seven inches, which is 18 centimetres by seven inches, 18 centimetres. So there are seven by seven square. Now, a lot of these, as I say, I do tend to cut the backs off and put them onto an eight by eight inch card because I like to add things around. And then it also means you're not actually putting anything onto the card. Or if you've watched my uh, card making video, you can use a bit of acetate and fix it at the back and put your greeting on the acetate. So it's not actually sticking to the picture. So if you want to put happy birthday or names, then they can be taken off easily afterwards. And you've still got your picture underneath if you want to frame it. But yeah, great quality. They're just blank inside. So you can either use your stamps or if you've got peel off stickers or greetings, just pop them inside. Or I like to put an insert in um, and put a greeting in and um, print those out. And then on the back, you've got all your licenses. You've got your Disney license there. You've got DIY Crystal Art Kit, Craft Buddy and your uh, website craftbuddyshop.com if you're wanting to um, check them out and see what else they've got. And then finally at the back is your uh, kit number, which if you check on your bags, your kit number is the same as what's on the back of the card. So if you do get your drills all muddled up, you can see there you've got your kit number there. Okay, there isn't any DMC numbers sadly on this one. Hi everyone, so just a quick update. Um, as you can see, <laughs> Craft Buddy now have a code on the back for all your letters and they have the DMC codes on them. Anybody that stores the drills and likes to keep them um, stored for future projects, you now have all your numbers on them. So that's brilliant. Thanks Craft Buddy. And I just thought I'd pop in and update this video because silly me, didn't even spot it when I did my unboxing. But that is excellent, well done. And thank you, Craft Buddy. We can now store our little spare drills away in the DMC number order. Thanks, guys. And there they're all just the code numbers. But uh, I tend to keep all my crystals and my ABs and the others, well, I'll match them up and sort them out eventually. <laughs> but I've got a massive bag full of drills that all need sorting. So yeah, so that's lovely. Let's just pop her back in her bag. I think she might be one of the first ones to be done. Um, we've got lots of little girls' birthdays coming up. Oops, they don't want to go in look. <laughs> when you're not watching what you're doing. Okay, pop those back in there and pop her in there. I'll keep the toolkit out for now. So yeah, so we've got Ariel, Mickey, Floating Olaf, Simba and Nala, Winnie the Pooh. It's actually, oh yeah, I've just realised it says here it's a Winnie the Pooh puzzle. So it's actually the shape of a jigsaw puzzle, that one. It isn't a puzzle, but the picture is the shape of a puzzle. We've got uh, Mini on Holiday, Bambi and Friends, Dory and Marlin, and then... My Lion King notebook. So, quite a lovely haul from Craft Buddy. They have got canvases, they have got other items as well, and they will be bringing out more in the range, so keep tuned. But thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this, please like and subscribe, and I'll hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.